Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you how to save your Canva design or pretty much just save it as a file, whether it be a PDF, a PNG, and even show you how you can make a template out of it so you can keep repeating the process, for example, with YouTube thumbnails. So here it is. Here's the final design. I did two previous videos about how you can create a thumbnail and I forgot to show you how to exactly save it. And I know there's a lot of questions about that. So here it is. Uh, a little interesting because it's hidden in the share button. So if you click on share right here, you're going to see that there's a download section right here. So yes, you can share it, but let's just go to download. And from here, what you can do is the file type. So you can do PNG, you can do JPEG or JPG, you can do your PDF. So this is where you're going to be uh, getting your PDF section. So uh, there's some sections right here. If you want to check those off, it also talks about them. Oops, didn't mean to click on that. But if you want more information about including notes, or if you want the uh, flattened and PDF uh, can help ensure it prints properly. That's up to you. There's also PDF print, which is best for printing. We have SVG, MP4 video, and GIF. But for example, like if I'm going to be saving this as a uh, just a PNG where I can use it for YouTube, what I'm going to do is go to PNG and click on download. And it should have a little thing right here where it says complete. And of course, it's going to show up right here, depending on the browser that you're using. And of course, you can always drag this to your desktop and then go from there, rename it and so on and so forth. So there's one more thing I want to talk about when it comes to saving templates. Naturally, when you have a Canva account, what you can do is go to the beginning and look for your recent design. So this is going to be the recent design. And if you're going to be creating YouTube thumbnails where you want to create a lot of them, what you can do just in case like you change this and you didn't want to, you can go here and you can just do make a copy. Okay. And what you can also do is just do like, you know, a uh, thumbnail template, something like that, of course. So what that means is that you can just go in here and change this around, you know, as many times as you want. So if you're changing thumbnails, you can just change around the headline, save it, and that's going to be your template. So it's naturally always going to be here, but it's cool to make a copy if you want to. But all in all, that's going to be a very quick tutorial when it comes to how you can save your designs, your files as PNGs, as PDFs, and of course, utilizing a template so that you can just keep going in there and repeating the process. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. In case you're watching this, you haven't gotten to test out Canva, I will have my link down below. They come with a free plan where you can pretty much do everything I showed you in this video. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video helped you out and I will see you in my next one.